number one, it's Morgan, and finally I get to tape my boxy charm. It's been torture. It's 1.30 a.m. And I actually get to open it now. See, it still has the seal on it. I usually cheat and open it immediately. Like, I can't not. So, if I am at all bitchy or eh about items, it is my complete honest opinion of the item. My opinion, not yours. Just putting that out there. Because I probably will be like that. Usually there's one or two items I don't like. But I know my choice better be in here or I'm really going to be mad. I'm still mad about not getting those lashes because I know I clicked that button. I'm bummed. I definitely hope I one day will find it in pop-up or something or add-ons or anything for a discounted price because there's no way I will ever buy them for 60 bucks. That's why I was so bummed. But anyway, that's been like two months ago. I'm still pissed off about December's box. But um, anyway, BoxyCharm for the month of February. So I am not going to open it that way because I don't have a knife. This is the way I always open it. I'm not fancy, and I don't pretend to be. Okay. Okay. So this is what I see when I open it. And the one thing that makes me a little annoyed is, why is this open? This should be shut. Okay. So I'm going to open the first thing because I know what it is. Which I'm so glad. They better have sent me the right one. Okay. Okay. Anytime we get Ace Butte, I think that's how you say it. But anyway, anytime we get this, I am so excited. I have two palettes already, which I'll be using more often because I kind of put it in the side, no, sideline. Not because I don't like it, but because I have like ones that I use all the time. So I am thinking that I'm going to use those and this one together and just do whatever looks I want. So I will be doing that soon because I know that I love this brand. If you could see it closer. Look how pretty. First of all, their packaging is beautiful. Always beautiful. It is a black owned company. Just in case you didn't know, but you probably already know that. Um, and I would love to see other items from them. I don't know if they make anything else. I haven't looked them up. I should, but uh, it's mostly because I don't buy anything. I get what I get, and then maybe I'll do an add-on, but I don't I don't have the money to spend. But if I did, I would buy their company stuff. Their company stuff. Their brands, because they're good quality. And I mean, the packaging alone, like a lot of people are like, oh my god, the packaging. No, this one is beautiful, and I like it. Oh, and it actually has a mirror. Sometimes they don't. There's one palette I've had that didn't have a mirror. The mirror is really big, which is nice. And these colors give me, oh my God. I'm sorry, but like, this makes me happy. When people are like, oh, jewelry makes me happy. Nah, eyeshadows like this. Make me happy. By the way, I'm wearing a lipstick that I got at Marshalls, it was $2.99, it's Sephora's brand, but that's what I'm wearing right now. It's really orange, but like I said, try new things. Oh my god. I am loving this. Loving, 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 loving this. I'm scared to touch it. Okay, well I definitely like, okay. So let me just show you the colors I like. I grab a tutu. Obviously the purple, that one right there. I like more pinky purples, but I'm gonna start trying more purple purple. Um, this camping color, this color, uh, that one, uh, that one. Um, obviously this pink right here, and then that shimmer. And then I'm really into yellows. I don't, I think I would one look, I have one video with one look on it, but I think I would try that one too. 
But like I said, I will be doing a whole bunch of stuff with this. Let me just swatch like one or two. So I'm going to swatch the purple that I'm a little worried about. But that is beautiful. Okay, this is the one I'm kind of worried about. That one. Then let me do the shimmery pink one. I mean, these are already swatched beautifully. The orange, because I'm a fan of orange. Let me do a little bit more justice. It's not it. It's me. And let me do this yellowy one. Mustard. I guess you would call it mustard. Okay, let's nicely be careful with the palette. I would be devastated if I broke that palette. I'm just saying. Like, there's some palettes I have that I don't care. Like, if it breaks, I'm like, okay, I can declutter that. But this. And just so you know, um, I think you would have to build up some of these mats. And that's not a bad thing, because this would be perfect for, like, yeah, just a you know, like you do, like you really can build those up. But I definitely think that purple is good. So it's more me needing to build it up. Nothing to do with the formula. I get totally, those shimmers are amazing. And again, other people will probably be doing tons of swatches. Watch their videos. Don't watch me for swatches. I am horrible at it. But oh my gosh. This is first thing. This already made the month. I don't even care what's in here. This makes me happy. So, I'm going to be very, very careful. Oh, let me do this. Everyone does this on, on here, and everyone gets all happy. Okay, see it? Okay, sorry. I always see people do that, so I had to do it. Okay, anyway. Oh, my God. It's so beautiful. I'm so excited. I'm definitely doing this tomorrow. I'm going to do something with this. Usually I put these aside and like forget about them when I get a palette. Not this one. Again, if you haven't checked out this brand, you definitely should. It is a very good one. And they always have the prettiest, again, packaging. I'm like, I love this. My mom's got all of the flowers. She loves flowers and plants. I have to say, this is probably my favorite out of the ones that we've gotten. And I think it's because there's so many choices. Like, you can go with any story you want. You could do pinks. You could do purples. You can do the green with, like, maybe the yellow or even green with purple. I don't know. I'm going to do weird looks. I'm going to do fun looks. I'm going to do very girly looks. And I'm excited. Okay, moving on. Because this will be an hour, thousand hours video if I do that. Okay next item and for me it doesn't matter the prices it matters the quality of the item I don't really care about the price but it's always nice to get you know expensive stuff okay I already see this and I'm excited because I think actually I have no idea what these are oh yeah they're brushes okay I was thinking they were brushes couldn't tell let me see Ooh, and first of all what do you see you see pink so you know I like it I don't know how to open anything. Okay, the more I'm watch seeing this lipstick, I actually like it. And it dries down matte. I did eat some food, so um, if there's holes in it, well, that's why. But. Okay, this, it sticks together. Okay, I just love this. It's so pretty. I already can, I can already tell. And that's the the brand. You know I don't read very well. I try. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> this totally screams Valentine's Day. Like, I know I always talk about how I hate Valentine's Day. This makes me like it. I mean, come on. This uh, I'm not in love with this. My mom's like, oh, another brush? Like, yeah, another brush. Do I use these? Probably not, but I love them. Look at this. Okay, I thought it was supposed to move around, but maybe it doesn't. I don't care. They're so pretty. Oh, they do move around. That one's just stupid. Sorry. Sorry. 
Okay, now it's working. Even if it doesn't work, I don't care. Because it's so pretty. So, definitely excited to have these. I will not be putting these in a use it or lose it because they're too pretty to get rid of. So regardless, even if I don't use them, they will be looked at a lot. And this is the perfect little thing to bring like brushes actually. I won't be storing them in here, but okay. I always drop something. It shouldn't be the brush. Put you on pause. Okay. I had to pick these up immediately. Usually I like wait until the end of the video, but not for a brush. Not on that gonna happen. These are beautiful. This would be perfect to like put some brushes in if you're going on a little trip. When we can tr go on trips. Or when at least it's safe to go on trips. I mean, people are going on trips all the time. If you do go on trips, be safe. So anyway, so far, two stars. I mean, two out of two. You know what I mean. Next item is... Okay, not excited about this. I'm not going to lie. Um, because... Everyone gets this in Ipsy, I think, and they always talk crap about it. It's true, people talk crap about this. But I'm always excited to get a mascara, I'm not gonna lie. I'm just not gonna use the eye curler thing. That thing's stupid. I do apologize, this is Logan speaking. But, uh, uh first of all, I don't use them because they're terrifying. The last time I did them, or try to curl my eye, eyebrows, eyelashes, um, it got stuck. And this thing is tiny. Like, what person could fit that? It would have been smarter if they made it like this size and then you just like, you know? So no, this is never going to happen and I won't even try. But I'm always down for mascara. And this looks like a gray wand. This is actually um, is kind of a shape I gravitate to anyway. So, no to this, but yes to this. And I'm not really into that brand anyway, because the last time I got it, I got a whole bunch of crayons for your face, and I have oily skin, so I'm not for it. But anyway, I do like this. And I'm always happy to get, let me see if I can get it out of here, a liner. I think it's gray. And I won't be using this because I don't use this type. But, um, oh, it looks black actually. Let me just kind of show you. Like I was saying, I don't use these types. I can't, I can't see what I'm doing, so I don't. I use um, the liquid ones because kind of like fix if I need to, which I usually do. So that will go to my sister eventually. Sometimes she'll get um, the kinds I like and like Ipsy and I'll switch her for like ones I don't like. So that will probably do that. And I'm excited. This is really like weighty. Like some of these are just crazy. Like I could hit someone with this. I don't know why, but I always think of like hitting people with items like mascaras. Like the one we got, um, was it last month or month before? It was the milk one. It was so heavy and weighted. I'm like, oh, I could beat someone up with it. I'm just thinking of my protection. Like if someone's behind me, I could just throw a mascara at them and it'd be perfectly fine. And it would cause lots of damage. Okay, so you can see what's in here. I'm gonna go with this one just because it is not a good color for me to read. Okay. Pore effect. Perfect primer. Per Sorry. It's perfect, but like perfect. And it's a base and it's matte finish, which is what I need. They do watch my No, I'm just kidding. They don't watch my videos, but they do look at your profile occasionally, I think, because it's not a luminous one, which is good. Okay, I'm not gonna open this because I, is it safety seal? 
safety seal, and then you do the song, safety seal. That's all I'm gonna do with that. Thank you, Abby. And um, I'm not gonna use this right now because if you haven't noticed, I have tons of primers, and um, this would just go bad. Because I think it's probably like, what, 12 months or whatever. So I'm gonna keep it, but um, this isn't like, whoa, but it is a very nice product and I'm happy again. So, I mean, I'm pretty happy with the Smots projects so far. Last item is this. Okay, so it looks like this. Oh, see, it, it, this is the bottom, and it fell, so it's actually like this. And this is a Tula skincare. Ooh, fancy. Okay. Okay, and either way, it wouldn't have got damaged, but you don't know what's in here. Like, it could have been a liquid, and it could be everywhere, so I'm excited. And um, it is, okay, dude, do they not see me? Do they not see my Mass Mondays and know how bad my skin is? This is for So Poreless Deep Exfoliating Blackhead Scrub. Should I be insulted? I'm just kidding. Seriously, like that's the worst. My nose is the worst area on my face. I am so excited to actually get a really good brand. I don't even know if I said it right. Tula, whatever. I don't care. It is nice and I'm excited. Okay, so yes. One point for this. Or one star. I'll do one star. One star. Half a star. For that. I mean, I do like it. Never mind. One star. It's one item. Like, just because I don't like part of it. That's just rude. Boring, but definitely something I can use. A star. This is just a five star bag. <coughs> Excuse me. These brushes are so cute. And then my favorite thing, which was my choice, is this. I'm just so glad I got the item I picked. Okay, let me put you on pause while I get the, if they gave me one, I will see if it's in here and then I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back and I have the thing. Isn't that cute? I love hearts. But, and, ow, did you hear that? Anyway, the Ace Beauté palette was $38.99, which I think is definitely reasonable for that. It's beautiful, and you can get many looks out of this. Uh, the Tula Skin Care product right here. Is $32, which, I mean, I think it's reasonable for skin care stuff. This is one I think they are crazy. And I think it's because there's two items in here, so I understand, but still, it's way too expensive. Uh, this is $44. Are you freaking kidding me? I mean, um, no offense, but the mascara I can see, okay, $18, $19. I mean, maybe it's more. I'm sure it is. But that liner is not that good. Like, I know that's going to break, which is why I don't like those. So we'll see, my sister, maybe we'll do a little review on it for me and maybe I'll tell you what she thinks, but $44, that's a little crazy. And that's more on the brand than Boxy because Boxy's putting what they write down. I would say $30, but I'm cheap, so what do I know? Okay, and then we have these cute brushes. And it says $29.95. Again, I think it's a little too much. Even though it's so adorable, those aren't face brushes. They're tiny little brushes. And I would say more like 20 bucks, not 29 I know it's just $9 or almost 10 but I don't know. Maybe you're paying for this too. It is really adorable. Don't get me wrong, but they're just branches. 
and then the primer is $23. So, yeah. I think that's reasonable for a primer. This will last you forever. Like, I have primers for, like, very, very long. So, again, my favorite thing would have to be the beautiful palette. And then, obviously, the black kids. I don't care because I need this. And then the brushes and then the primer and then the mascara. Just because the price is just, like, kind of, like, eh. Kind of. I mean, think about that. That is the most expensive thing in this. The palette should be the most expensive thing. Not a mascara. Like, I think that's what it is. A mascara, 20 bucks. So you're basically saying that your mascara is better than, better than Sex Mascara, which is my favorite. Or better than Big Ego by Tarte. I mean, come on. Like, nah. Mm -mm. Nope. No. Did I, I didn't even check to see what, did I check? Yeah, I did check to see what it is. I don't know. I don't think about that. This is no. It makes me mad actually to see that. So I give this half a point again. I went back down to half a point. So four and a half stars for this. Mostly because this price it pisses me off a little bit. I'm sorry. That's as angry as I'm going to get today. I mean, in my real life, I'm angry all the time. So be positive here. But, um... What do you think? I would give you like the number, but they're being like shady about it now. And that is, I'm calling them out on that because they got read multiple times about the fact that there's so many versions, right? A hundred something. So they put these weird numbers so no one knows what they're getting. Also, I don't weigh these. I think it's stupid to weigh them. Because what if one item is the same thing as another item? I don't know. So, just let it be a surprise. It's fun that way. <laughs> I can't believe I was actually able to wait four hours to even open this. And more than four hours because it's like almost two o'clock in the morning now. And I got it at 8 p.m. Can you imagine if I had to wait a couple of days to open this? Mm hmm. Now, I will try to do that every month because it's kind of fun. And if I get angry, you'll see it. So, but my Ipsy is not going to happen because I always check that thing. And I always do a pick one item if I can, if I like them. Like if there's a brush, I'll pick that. Or if it's mascara, I'll pick that. I think I, what's funny is I think I picked... A moisturizer and then I got that moisturizer at the last last month so that's why it looked fresh in my head you know it's like oh okay I'll get it so now I'm gonna have two moisturizers for my face but I'm like what if I like it then I have a backup at least so anyway I know you don't care about that so like subscribe and comment down below what did you get well I'll probably check it out I'll probably watch a couple videos I got mine so soon. It's so weird. Like, I never get them on the 6th. Like, that's crazy. They're definitely um, doing way better on the shipping. So good for them. And I can't wait on the 8th to find out what I will buy. And what choices are. Because I don't even know what choices are this month. I think, eh, if I find something I like, cool. If not, like, this month was really good. Like, this was a good month. So anyway, have a good day now that this is almost like 5,000 hours. Bye.